We're on Main Street in Mandan for the Mandan Rodeo Days, 4th of July celebration, one of the great traditions that we've always done. For 30 plus years is we've hosted a road race here. It's such a great long-standing tradition to have this road race in Mandan and we're super excited to be partnered with them this year and we hope it continues. The race is a 5k run or walk. Uh, it's a non-competitive run so we just want people to come out and have a great time. The race is $30 and $10 from every registration this year goes to the Cancer Center Foundation. We provide wraparound services for those who are dealing with cancer in our community. Those include massage therapy, spiritual and emotional care, transportation and lodging assistance, and that money all stays local and helps our neighbors and family and friends going through cancer right here. Me and my, my brother James, we ran for, for years in college and high school, so we love the non-competitive atmosphere. Well, I started off uh, in high school, I used to help run this race with my high school coaches. Um, once they retired, I took it over because it was a tradition. Then my brother started to help out and started to help it grow. When we started, we were at about 200 runners and now we're getting close to 500 runners and it continues to grow. We see a lot of returning runners. We see a lot of runners from across the country that come back home every year and they do this race and it becomes part of their kind of family tradition as they come home every year for the 4th of July. I grew up in Minneapolis and the patriotic city that is Mandan, North Dakota, blows away the feeling that you get at the local events back home in Minneapolis. Two years ago, when I was pregnant with uh, my second daughter, I saw a bunch of people racing while I was stuffing my face with pancakes. And I said, someday I want to do that. And I quit smoking a year ago and started running. And I said, I'm going to do the 4th of July race. I plan on doing the race every year, hopefully next year with one of my little girls. You know, it brings families together and that's what we wanted to do with this event.